So we stayed at quite a few Airbnbs while we were in Bali, and when we got to our third, it was unlike anything that we've seen before. Even though it was in Ubud Center, just 40 second walk from Ubud Palace, it was also in the jungle. I'm serious, there was a river and bamboo and nature and wildlife and bugs. I saw the biggest lizard I have ever seen in my life. View from the balcony. Oh, he moves so weird. It's like, he moves like a snake. But the first thing I notice are all these ants. And I think to myself, this place doesn't get enough foot traffic to justify ants. There just aren't enough people around. But you see where my thinking was flawed, right? Because ants predate dinosaurs. They didn't survive all that time on Nabisco cracker crumbs. I ask myself the question, what do ants eat? Graphic content warning, this might get ugly. I was doing a commercial for a client and I saw this black cluster. It was ants surrounding a gecko. This gecko was dead and they were tearing at it. They were peeling back the skin. They were getting at the flesh. They were tugging at it. Because like us, ants are omnivores. They don't just survive on Chips Ahoy cookies, but also meat and also fruit and plant and other bugs and other animals like geckos. But instead of ripping them apart, they start moving them. They start carrying him slowly but surely. So I go back and I get my film equipment and I come back and they're gone. I swear, only 30 seconds have passed. And I looked everywhere. I must have spent half an hour looking for these ants with the gecko and I don't know where they went. A few hours later, they're back same exact spot. And I'm confused because I think at this point, either I'm crazy or the ants are gaslighting me. So I go and I run and I get Ashley and I show her and they're gone again. I'm feeling very distressed at this point. I feel the ground where they were to make sure they didn't turn invisible. It was really freaking me out. But then we found where they went. They were defying gravity, carrying the gecko up a pillar. It was astonishing to see. I've never seen anything like it. I got a selfie with them. Now I knew that ants could carry several times their own weight, but I didn't know they could do it while climbing a wall. I couldn't get the rest of the journey because there was a ceremony we were invited to. We didn't want to miss it, but here are a few takeaways. Number one, nature is amazing. Number two, insects are beautiful and frightening. Number three, teamwork makes the dream work. And number four, Bali is beautiful. If you like this video and you want more, you learned something new, you had fun, subscribe, click the bell, and we'll see you in the next video.